Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, my name is Divya. If you're not new here, welcome back. So welcome to day eight of Cheers with Div, I think, I'm not sure. So in this video, we're going to be talking about my January TBR. So I'm going to like show you the process of me choosing the books and let's show it now. Okay, I hope you had fun watching <laughs> my both my parents were watching me do that they were like what are you doing and I'm like it's for the views it's for the views so let me talk about the books that I pulled out so the first one is a newer book which is the girl in the tower by Catherine Arden this is the second book in the winter night trilogy I have yet to read the first book which is the bear and the nightingale so this is so I'll be reading that first and then reading this so I'll be reading like more than I took out so that's the rules law if I pick the second book I have to read the first book first so this uh, series is centered around Russian folklore for the first book we have we follow our character Vasya if I'm not mistaken that's her name and like the Russian folklore and winter and then comes this religious stepmother who doesn't believe in the folklore and they have to save the town and something like that so I'm very excited to read that book first and then read this book as well the next book I chose was also a sequel which is Arusha and the Song of the Dead but the first book is Arusha and the End of Time, wrote by Roshani Chokshi. So this is part of the Rick Riordan imprint. This is around Indian mythology and I'm very excited to start this series. And the fact that I chose this is like really well because I wanted to start this series for a long time. So finally going to start it. The next book is something that I was supposed to buddy read with Mari in November. Or October but I didn't get to which is The Night Tiger by Yang Si Chu. This is part, like a Malay like it's set in Malaya back then it, before it became Malaysia 1930. So I will read to you the synopsis. In 1930s Malaya 11 year old houseboy Ren has a secret mission to find his dead master's severed finger and reunite it with his body. Ren has 49 days or else his master's soul will roam the earth forever. Ji Lin, an apprentice dressmaker, moonlights as a dance hall girl to pay her mother's debts. One night, Ji Lin's dance partner leaves her with a gruesome souvenir that leads her on a dark trail. As time runs out for Ren's mission, a series of unexplained deaths occur amid rumors of tigers who turn into men. In their journey to keep a promise and discover the truth, Ren and Jilin's paths will cross in ways they will never forget. So I'm very, very excited to finally, finally start this and maybe I can chat to Mari about this. So the next series of books are books that I bought in high school so they're very backlisted books so yes so the first book is the elegance of the hedgehog by mira barbary i have no idea what this book is about i t i don't know why i bought this book <laughs> i really don't uh but apparently i was like yes i'm going to buy this book when i was younger so i'm very excited to read this and hopefully i will like it hopefully the next is a manga series which is bungo stray dogs I bought this at my local bookstore here in where, where I live and I bought this like two years ago if I'm not mistaken and I was like when I saw it I was like yes I'm going to read this but like then I didn't read it so I'm trying to read more manga series in 2021 so this is perfect to start off that journey. Now I think a lot of book people really love this book and I've had it for quite some while and I'm finally going to be reading it at this month I guess which is The Night Circus by Erin Morgenstern. 
Uh, so everybody and your mother has already read this book except me. So I'm very uh, much inclined to go into this book. So the circus arrives without warning. No announcements preceded. It's simply there when yesterday it was not. It's called Cir Le Cirque de Rive and it's only open at night. So the night circus. So I'm very excited for this. So the last book is the first book in a series called The Circle of Magic by Tamara Pierce, which is Sandry's book. So I'm very excited to read this because I've been holding on to this for a very long time and I really wanted to get to it. but. You know me, you know me. So with her gift of weaving silk thread and creating light, Sandry is brought to the Winding Circle community. There she meets Briar, a former thief who has a way with plants, Daja, an outcast gifted at Metalcraft, and Triss, whose connection with the weather unsettles everyone, including herself. At Winding Circle, the four misfits are taught how to use their magic and to trust one another. But then disaster strikes their new home. Can Sandri weave together four kinds of magical powers and save herself, her friends, and the one place where they've all ever been accepted? So I'm very excited for that as well. So I hope that you enjoyed this very weird video and that you had fun enjoying it. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye y'all!